Welcome to Infididia. Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 comes hidden with electronic image stabilization feature. Asus has recently launched its new budget oriented phone in India, the Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1, which goes against the likes of Xiaomi Redmi Note 5 Pro and other budget offerings by Chinese manufacturers. The phone has been touted to come with many impressive features and has even been claimed to surpass some of its competitors in terms of specs. However, there is one feature which the company might have overlooked while marketing the phone, that is, electronic image stabilization. However, according to a new finding by an XDA member, it's been pointed out that the Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 does come with EIS. Read ahead to know how you can enable the EIS settings on your Asus phone. Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 Enabling EIS on Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 The EIS settings on the Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 have been located in the camera app. For the unaware, the Zenfone Max Pro M1 comes with Snapdragon camera application. To enable EIS, open the camera app and then go to Settings. Navigate to the tab which reads Red Eye Reductions, tap on the button again and again until you get a notification saying that the additional settings have been enabled. In the camera app now, switch to 1080p Full HD or lower settings while in the video mode. The image stabilization will now be visible in the settings and you will be able to toggle it on. With the image stabilization toggled on on the Zenfone Max Pro M1, you will be able to record comparatively less shaky videos. The image stabilization isn't the only hack in the Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 since Asus has overlooked a hidden fastboot command that allows for enabling the Camera 2 API without a need to modify system files. Using this backdoor, the phone users will also be able to install the Google Camera application on their device. Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 Specifications The Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 sports a 5.99-inch IPS LCD which offers a resolution of 1080x2160 Full HD and on an 18,9 aspect ratio screen. Asus has said that the screen offers a brightness of 450 nits. Under the hood, the phone runs on an octa-core Qualcomm Snapdragon 636 chipset which clocks 1.8 GHz and comes paired with Adreno 509 GPU. The variants of the Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 include a 3GB RAM and 32GB storage variant, 4GB RAM and 64GB storage, and 6GB RAM and 64GB storage variant. In case you need more storage, the phone also offers a microSD card slot. The phone comes with a rear-mounted fingerprint sensor and along with that also offers face unlock capability. The camera setup on the Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 also differs according to the variants. The 3GB and the 4GB RAM variant of the smartphone feature a 1.3MP plus 5MP dual rear camera setup, whereas the 6GB RAM variant features a much better 1.6MP plus 5MP dual rear camera setup. The phone also allows for shooting videos in 4K Ultra HD resolution. On the front, the 3GB and 4GB RAM version of the device comes with an 8MP snapper, on the other hand, the 6GB RAM option comes with a 1.6MP snapper. Connectivity options on the phone include Wi-Fi 802.11a slash b slash g slash n slash ac dual band, Bluetooth 5.0 low energy, GPS with a GPS, GLONASS, and dual 4G Volte. The Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 also packs massive 5000 mAh battery, and it also comes with NXP Smart Amp powered by a 5-magnet speaker. The phone runs on Android 8.1 Aria out of the box. Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 Pricing The entry-level version of the Asus Zenfone Max Pro M1 which comes with 3GB of RAM and 32GB of internal storage retails for Rs 10,999. The 4GB RAM and 64GB storage option bears a price tag of Rs 12,999, while the top-end 6GB RAM and 64GB storage variant is available for Rs 14,999. The color options for the phone include black, grey, and blue and the phone is available for buying on Flipkart. And as always, thanks for watching.